The following segment is sponsored by Hewitt's Garden Center. The weather lately certainly has got us thinking about spring, and there's finally a spring project that we need to tackle right away. And this is starting begonias. Begonias are a tuber. There are types that grow from seed, but we're talking about the tuberous begonias now. These are for shade gardens, great flowers. In fact, these pictures here, just about life size for these begonias, but they're slow, slow starters. So this would be a great weekend sometime in the next couple of weeks to get these started, because if you get a good start now, you're gonna have flowers sooner. If you wait and plant them outside in your garden in the middle of May, you won't get flowers until late, late in the season. So it's pretty easy stuff. You can see there's lots of different colors available. I'm starting some mixed ones here and here's what they look like now kind of looks like a clump of dirt but you see it's got a rounded side and a kind of a dish side and if you look closely you can see the little nubs of shoots starting to come up already so how do we start these just a little pot like this I like to use sterilized potting soil of course so that's nice and you won't get any weeds or any diseases in there it's nice and sterile just put a little hole in the middle of it like that and you want to make sure you put the dome side down and the dish side up where the sprouts are coming from. If there's no sprout, just go with the dish side up. Just nestle it in. They don't want to be real deep. As big as they are, you would think they'd go deeper, but they don't. And just tuck them in like that. About an inch of soil on top of them. And then to activate them, get them started, let them know it's time to grow. You want to soak them in real well with some water. They don't need light right away while they're growing some roots, so you can just put them somewhere nice and warm, like on top of the refrigerator or a warm room, just to get them started. Once you see the shoots starting to poke up out of the, out of the soil, you know, move them to a sunny window, and then in the middle of May, move them outside to your shady garden for great color all summer long. For Hewitt's Garden Centers, this is Peter Bowden.